The Minister of State for Steel Development, Oba Amadou, says it's important to invest in the future of the welding industry and tap into its potentials for economic sustainers. He stated this at the second annual assembly and conference of the Welding Federation in Africa. Zainab Akonde was there. They may be seen as mere artisans, but their work is more than meets the eye. That is why at the Second Welding Federation Annual Assembly, engineers, industrialists and policy makers are gathered to change this narrative, interact and share experiences. The conference aims to increase commitment to welding capacity development, technical collaborations and encourage careers in the welding industry. Not just welders by themselves, but also business who use welders and academia who allow for the development of welders. So we bring all of the different forces together to ensure that the whole business of welding is able to proceed as it's meant to with all of its uh, opportunities that are presented in Nigeria and Africa beyond. The Minister of State for Steel Development, Uba Maigari Amadu, said the federal government is committed to develop the welding sector through investment and partnerships. Visionary leadership of our president. As you are Tunubu GCFR, whose renewed hope agenda recognizes the critical importance of the welding industry. His policy initiatives focused on modernizing training facilities, fostering industry collaboration, and promoting skilled workforce development. To foster economic integration, stakeholders emphasize the need to create an enabling environment for investors and increase the confidence in Africa as a preferred hub of cost-effective manufacturing. As technology continues to take the front border in advancement, experts gave a detailed illustration of a modernized welding simulator to improve the learning process. We can really give qualified welders if we train them properly. So this technology is actually for that, is to attract that new generation of welders and trade them in a very engaging but also efficient, safe and green way using augmented reality technology. The participants believe that through collaborative effort like this, a new generation of successful African welders and a sustainable economy will be achieved.